we're at Long Cross, which is an ex-military test facility. What we've got here is basically the rooftops in Turkey that we're going to jump over once we add our pieces to it. It's actually easy for us to build it all out of dirt because we can tweak it and move it about, make it longer, make it bigger, very easy rather than having set pieces made. And I can video it and show it to Sam so he knows what roughly he's getting. And then again, we we'll, we'll go out there and then we'll rehearse the whole thing up to the your practice for us. The bikes we got are 250 CRF Hondas, which is like absolutely ideal for this stuff. You know, they do motocross. Supercross all over the world, you know, they're renowned for being out of the box, one of the best bikes you can get. Obviously we're going to dress them up to look like road bikes, police bikes, so you won't basically recognise them, but underneath it will be a full-blown motocross bike. Today we're in Istanbul, this is like a quarter of the way through the beginning of the opening sequence and we're now getting onto the bike section of the chase. And they've come here, there's been a big crash, there's been a shootout, Patrice has escaped from the bike, Bond now jumps on the bike and he chases him and from here it takes us through like another little marketplace and then we're onto the rooftop sequence. I think every bunt is unique, they all have their own stunts, they all have their own story. I think to do a chase up on the bazaar roof, I think it's something unique. But you have very narrow uh, little um, walkways that is a challenge for the riders. The strips of, of concrete are barely a metre wide, uh, so we have to have people stationed at each end to physically turn the bike, literally pick it up sometimes and turn it around and send it back up to its, its start mark. It's easy to knock the rider off and you have, to, you have to have people who know how it all works. Honda make a good product and uh, we don't have to do a lot of maintenance to the bikes. We just replace things like exhaust and levers and handlebars when their bikes are crashed and if you crash a bike, stuff's going to get broken. Well, I'm uh, Aussie freestyle motocross rider. I own a few world records for longest jump with my motorcycles kind of following Evil Knievel's footsteps and I've done some different things on motorbikes. I'm looking for someone to double bond and I've got the call up. Going to the roof was probably the scariest thing for me. There's just really tight lines, you know, obviously with no helmets on doing these stunts, you run the risk, but I saw some of these shots just kind of looking over the guy's shoulders when they were reviewing what they got and some of it looks really impressive, so I'm, I'm excited to see how it's going to come when they cut it up in the studio. Jumping into the bazaar was nice. Again, a little bit different, you know, a little bit unusual. So it was a proper, you know, a good 14 foot drop down. So, you know, not easy stuff by any means. I was scared just because I didn't have a helmet on, but the first day we had to do that, that stunt out of the roof. So luckily we got it on the first take, didn't have to do it too many times. You know, Gary Powell and Alex and Sam Mendes, all these guys who are, who are involved with producing and, and directing this film, it's just a pleasure to work with, with these guys. You know, obviously a lot of the stunt guys here are, amazing guys and I really feel like I've become part of the family.